G'day everyone, welcome back. It's been a minute. <laughs> been pretty uh, busy organizing stuff. Um, yeah, so just wanted to give a quick update. So for those of you who haven't seen, we've been posting on, on social media about um, Fear of the Mind. It was a short film that we did oh, a few years ago, I think now. So it's a fan-based film uh, developed around the character of Scarecrow from the Batman universe. So obviously being a fan film, we're not affiliated with DC or anything like that. Um, you can make the films, you just have to put disclaimers on uh, uh, stating that. So the film's finished. Um, we are screening it with a version on the 9th of December at the back lot. So if you're um, able to make it along, that would be great. The tickets are available to purchase on the um, Fear of the Mind Facebook page through Try Booking. They are $25, but all the money from the ticket sales is going to Breast Cancer WA. Uh, so it is going to a charity. I think Breast Cancer have asked to have a banner, banner put up there as well. So that'll be getting put up. And there are four lots of screenings. There's, the first screening is 5.15 to 5.45. I will link all this in the video as well, but just to give you an idea, 5.15 to 5.45. So they're half an hour screenings. I think a few of the mine's 22 minutes or something and, and a version's eight. And then there's 6.15 to 6.45, 7.15. You get the ideas. And then 8.30... We're going to do a quick 15-minute Q&A with myself and Nate and maybe one or two others. And then from there, we're just going to head over to Leadville, have a few drinks if you want us. Um, so that's how the, the 9th of December is going to pan out. So there are four screenings. So if you can't make it to the early ones, there are some later ones. Um, and the tickets are, are available on Try Booking. <clears throat> there is a trailer as well on there. But what I'm going to try and do is quickly see if I can share my screen and uh, play play the trailer for you now i've just got to find it first 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 where is it let me work out where it is hang on uh here it is here okay no, it's not working. I'll figure it out, guys, and I will try and share it with you. Otherwise, you can check on the Facebook page and it's on there. So <clears throat> in the film, everyone does an American accent. We had James Hagen as a vo voice coach. He was it was really good. Um, unfortunately, he passed away, so this film is dedicated to him. He was the one that, um, he was the one that did all the voice coaching. And, uh, and this by this. Garibald. It's 23. Now. Don't you want to go home? Ah! Oh, no, please. Your destiny belongs only to you. So there you have it, everyone. That's the trailer. Um, yeah, we just... Uh, I'm going to work out to get this off here now. Uh, let's see. Cool. Yep. Um, that's it. So that's a quick trailer for it. Again, like I said, James Hagen did... Um, did the um, the vo the vocal training, um, and I think it wasn't long after we filmed that that he actually passed away. So this film is dedicated to him. He is in it as well. So yeah, we look forward to seeing everyone down there. There are some actors from the film that can't make it, which is un um, unfortunate. Depending on how we go with the screening, we may put some more on. It will be getting entered into festivals. Like I said, we can't make any money from it because it is a fan film. So any money that we do make from the ticket sales will be going to Breast Cancer WA. So it's going to a good cause. And um, the film actually has come out come out pretty well. So, yeah. 
So I just want to give that update. Also, a version, for those of you who don't know, will be getting made as a feature. We are just re rejigging the script a little bit now to um, accommodate the, the, the budget that we have um, <clears throat> and um, get it made for, for the amount. I won't disclose the amount that we have at the moment. Uh, so, yeah, we're looking at doing that. That should be ready in a week or so's time, and then we'll go over it and and see how it goes. We're, we're aiming to make it more contained, so make it more of a um, a psychological thriller. So just focus in more on a couple of the characters and, and have it essentially in one location, so it makes it quite easy. And um, that's really about all the updates at the moment. Um, I'm just trying to think if there's anything else really. Oh, I've got an interview coming up Saturday morning. So it is, I'm just uh, having a look now. I'm actually going to be doing doing a live interview with a guy in the States. So it's 10 a.m. my time, is it? No, hang on. Yep, 10 a.m. my time on Saturday. So I'm interviewing a guy called Jaron Hall, who's going to be the first, flying in from the States to be the first AD on a version. Um, so I'll be interviewing him live. So if you're not doing anything 10 a.m. Saturday, tune in. And then I'm still trying to work out the times, but a lady called Amber from Beyond Film School on YouTube. Check that channel out. I'll link that here as well. I'm going to be interviewing her because she's also a full-time filmmaker in the States and she, I think she's a first aid, uh, uh, either a first AD or um, a production manager, one of the two. So um, she does put up a lot of videos in regards to how it works on set. So I'll, when I get a chance to interview her, I will. But Jaron is also a full-time filmmaker in the States, and I think he, he travels between the US and the UK, but he's flying over on his own dime to to work on a version, which is awesome, and um, he'll be here for the entirety. So although it's going to be a 15-day, probably 12, 15-day shoot, it will be scattered because obviously with the budget, we're not able to pay everyone the full rate to work every single day, so it'll probably just be a couple of weekends here, a couple of weekends there. We are aiming for around maybe March, February. We, 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 because it's predominantly filmed at night time, we want to avoid blocking out windows. So as you know now, the sun's going down at about 7.30 at night and coming up early. So we're only going to get, if we were to film it now, we'd only get three, four, maybe five hours of filming in. Whereas if we do it closer to winter where the sun's down earlier and up later, then we can get almost 10 hours of filming in, and especially if we're only doing weekends. So we're doing that to try and maximise the amount of time and, and, and say blocking out windows and things like that. It may not work that way, but that's that's the aim. Also, R Rob Rob from Rough Road Media has come on board as a sponsor. Although he couldn't put in physical cash, he is um, allowing allowing us to use cameras and lenses and uh, jibs and and all different types of stuff up to the value of what his um, of what his contribution would have been. So that's awesome. So when we're ready to film, we'll have all that gear ready to go. Um, and yeah, we are still looking for for people if you want to. Um, invest in a version. We will be running a crowdfunder through the Australian Cultural Fund probably next year, just because as, as it's getting closer to Christmas now, we're pretty sure people don't, you know, people want to focus on that. Uh, with the Australian Cultural Fund though, it is a tax deduction. So if, if you're in a 30 or 40% bracket, so you don't get a physical reward, um, but you can claim it on tax. So if you put in say 20K and you're in the 40% tax bracket, you get 6,000 back, et cetera. You can do the math uh, depending on what you put in. But, you know, if you did want some sort of physical reward, I'm sure, <coughs> excuse me, I'm sure there's something we could arrange. So that's really it for the updates at the moment. You'll see at the bottom here, I've got, uh, you, I've also got a Patreon page as well as you can follow me on the socials. A lot of the updates for a version of stuff will be posted on the um, Patreon page. Same with maybe some behind the scenes photos for Fear of the Mind stuff. So if you do want to see all that, you will have to subscribe. It starts at $5 a month. Um, and then there'll be content on there that you won't that I won't put on on any other platforms. It just helps me a little bit to you know keep this going. And and I want oh, I'm going to be doing a, a Christmas event like a networking event at the island in Elizabeth Key. That's looking at the 17th of December. It's just Sunday, so you know uh, you buy obviously people purchase their own drinks, but I'll, I'll be looking at putting some food on. I do need to confirm exact numbers because they did say for every person that doesn't turn up, I will get charged $15 a person. So if I have 30 people coming, I was saying they're going to come, then I'd like 30 people to turn up, um, that type of thing. Obviously, the event, you don't, there's no tickets for anything or for it. Um, that'll be coming up then. And also, so, you know, if you were to, to subscribe to 
Patreon that would help me as well with that type of thing and just different things. So you don't have to. It's obviously not there. But if you do want to see updates from projects coming up, then most of it will be on there. So, um, again, I'll link all that in the video and um, I'll try and post a trailer for Fear of the Mind in there as well. Again, it's on the Facebook page. I am looking at maybe getting to try and do, uh, script supervising as well. It's something that, that I think would be interesting. I'm just chatting to the to my mate in the States now. Um, so he's just giving me some advice on it. But, yeah, I'll see. It might be something else because there's not a lot of stuff I'm doing producing-wise, so I just want to try something else and see how it goes. All right, guys, that's it for this video. I will do another one later on. Um, I'm thinking of getting back into the producer series or doing my filmmakers after dark, so interviewing people um, where you know anything sort of goes. But I'll work on that as I go along, and um, I will chat to you all later. Bye.